guys, thank you so much for your feedback on yesterday's video. I asked what type of videos did you specifically want to see on my channel. A big request was more variety in the videos and one of those requests was more fire videos. So I reinstalled the rescue mod by Gang Green. This modification allows you to be EMS, paramedics, and coast guard. And uh, before we actually begin, get on duty, take fire call outs, I want to take a look at this fire truck. I've had this fire truck in the game for quite some time. It's a mod by Medic, and it is the Rosen Bauer engine. I think I'm pronouncing that right. It looks like a, a newer model just based on how it looks. Now, I don't know too much about fire trucks, I'll be honest, and uh, fire departments, so my you know if i mispronounce something or something is uh different just you know leave a comment down below correcting me but uh we'll take a look at the outside this thing has a ton of equipment and it's part of medic's uh larger pack so i'm thinking we could do several episodes and just switch out the different types of fire trucks we've got our hoses back there we got a ladder up top Lots of LED lights, this thing lights up. We'll take a look at it outside here in a second. There's our unit number, all these gauges, not really sure what they all do, but they're all, they all serve a purpose. Let's hop in the car. We're gonna go into first person here and see what we can see. So here's the steering wheel center console you can see uh, it looks like it's seats one two three four at uh, we six here up in the front so we'll pull this thing out and uh, we'll light it up take a look at the lighting I really like these LEDs up front in the grill. I think they look really cool. You can see the logo lights up too. Lots of LEDs on the truck. I think it looks awesome. This is a truck we'll be using today. We'll go on duty here shortly. Take some call outs. We'll see uh, what we run into today. Getting a call out about a commercial structure fire. Palomino Avenue, we're gonna go ahead and respond to this one. Just be running solo, of course this is not realistic, but is what it is. Activate our lights, we've got a water truck here. You can see the hose on top. Controllable with the controller. So we'll activate the siren and uh, we'll head in route. About a mile away from the scene. We can hide that panel by hitting I. Using the same rumbler siren we use as a police in the police cars. There we go. It's always a challenge getting to the scene in the fire truck can't drive quite as fast as we do in police cars. I really don't want to go on the the track if I can avoid it. Look at that car moving out of the way. Perfect. See that? That was perfect. He moved quickly and efficiently out of the way safely. That was beautiful. So if this car in the left doesn't move, we'll probably, this is how we'll do it. <laughs> yep. The other challenge is not to hit things. We'll probably be the first on scene. All 
Alright, this is gonna be a little bit of a challenge. Make a right turn up ahead and we'll see what we got in store. Here's a, it's going to be on the left side. It's going to be the bingo. Dispatch, we're going to be on scene here. Oh yeah. Engine 5 show me on scene. There is a fire. We definitely have a fire. We can use our mod menu here and uh, we'll get our loadout gear. Engine get some more 5 firefighters requesting on scene. FD on scene. Looks like we're going to have to use this to get our fire loadout. Can't really use the hose, so we'll have to use a fire extinguisher. All right, let's go ahead and make our way in here. If there's anybody in here, we can use the menu to order additional people out. Gosh, this thing's overtaking the front door. Whoa. Gotta be careful if I get caught on fire here. It's not gonna end well. There's our backup, perfect. Is there anybody in here? Oh, we got more fire. Make sure we don't have anybody trapped in here. That's another important role of a firefighter. All right, it looks to be clear here. Make sure the whole fire is put out. Let's see where it burned the desk. What the heck started this thing? All right, let's look on the outside here. Seems to be okay. All right, we'll put our equipment back. It looks like the fire is out. Update our status as well. Engine 5 show me available. Engine 5 respond to a brush fire address is El Burro Boulevard. All right, removing our equipment. Put that back in and then let's take off our fire gear. Right, that's removed we didn't put any road cones so road cones can be put out if we need to divert traffic away from the scene but uh, I think we're okay here all right what we're gonna do now is take it back to the station looks like scene's gonna be secured and uh, correct me if I'm wrong but I think after a situation like this occurs the uh, fire inspector would come out and try to determine what the cause of the fire was and if there's any like malicious intentions behind it but uh, we'll clear from this scene we'll head back to the fire station engine 5 respond to a vehicle fire address is grove street 
All right, we're going to dispatch to a vehicle fire on Grove Street. We'll go ahead, head out there, see what's going on. Grove Street's really close to us, actually. So this will be a quick trip. I wish pedestrians would respond to lights and sirens. It seems to be a bug. Yeah, we're a quarter mile away, so we're really close. Vehicle fires could be dangerous, especially if somebody's trapped inside. It's reported right down the road. Oh, yep, we do have a fire here. Dispatch, we're going to be on scene. We got a vehicle on fire. Let's walk off the road here. We got our equipment on. Somebody's running into us. Let's uh, get police on scene. Engine five requesting PD on scene. It's kind of a rough area. Get the fire extinguisher and uh, I'll try to put out some cones. Nobody is. Stopping. Engine 5, show me on scene. Now, this thing was on fire. It looks like it might have put itself out. We'll investigate it here in a second. Okay, it looks like for the cones, I'd have to take the equipment off, so we're not. Oh my gosh, can we stop getting hit? That's why I want police on scene. I've been hit two times. This thing is smoking, though. Let's see if I can pop this hood. My fire truck has been completely moved from cars hitting it. I'm gonna see if we can go in here, look at our vehicle options, and see if we can get this thing open, open hood. There we go. So it's definitely smoking. It looks like it did briefly catch fire. But other than that, I think it's gonna be okay. Right, from what I'm telling, the scene looks secure. We'll get a tow truck out here to go ahead and pick up the car. This is crazy though with the traffic. We'll have to figure out a better way to situate the traffic so people don't go so crazy because I would like to put out fires without my car getting hit by everybody. But we will go ahead and update Engine our status. Engine 5 show me available. Put this up too and we will head back to the station i don't even think the police ever got here this area always makes me feel very unsafe pulling back into the station that's going to end our night shift out of Davis. If you guys want to see more firefighting videos, please let me know. We've got a lot of different fire trucks we can use from that medics pack. Leave a comment down below. Thanks for watching guys and I'll see you on the next episode.